Hello everyone and welcome back to Altria's Plays. Uh, Dead Cells on the wrong... How many do we get? Seven? How many friends do I have? Three? Nah. Not that many. Dead Cells. Hello. Welcome. Thank you for joining me. I have been doing some test recordings and I have determined that against all the odds, NVIDIA encoding is the most superior of all encodings. Mostly because if you ramp up the bitrate to 20,000 you um, get a decent quality excuse me, recording um, without using up any of your CPU, which is very important. Tried using my CPU to do even a... What did I put it at? 3,000? I was asked to do 5,000K. 5,000K. 5K. Um, no, pick this up as well. A 5K recording. Um, that's the bit rate of the X264 the MP4, okay, it's the bit rate of the MP4, um, and my computer couldn't cope with that, <laughs> it was too difficult, and as a result we ended up with a very choppy video which still had pretty terrible video quality. I don't know, I, I might need some someone to teach me this because whenever I look on the internet at you know, recommended recording settings for YouTube videos, especially if doing Let's Play, they always say use a. Um, no, I've got some time. Use a uh, a bit rate between you know two and a half and five thousand. Five thousand is usually considered to be the maximum bit rate you ever need for for um for YouTube. <laughs> I'm going. Excuse me. In any situation, because. Oh, hang on. I'm going to go perps for now, um, simply because this is a perp, and also I presume that our secondary weapon is going to remain being a perp. That's a, a purple, not a perpetrator. You know? I'm not a cop, I'm not a police cop. I don't talk in those terms. I people told me that NV anchors are just a shitty instance of the. H264 algorithm, which is why it always seemed bad whenever I did it. I'm going to uh, scarf it now so I can make the time door. <sighs> yeah. So I think let's try it differently. Try 5k, which is the max recommended, um, in software mode. You know, the, the FFmpeg's favourite mode. What have we got available to us? We should... Ooh, Ice Bow. I do like the sound of that, but I prefer the sound of Health Flask 2. The return of the Health Flask. Wait. Combo, please. I'm not going to go for Isdar unless I'm expecting to do something extremely difficult, like an Elite or something like that. For now, we're just going for progress. 5,000 had... The, the video quality was bad. You know, I, it was not acceptable to me. I was downright um, Let's watch this. A little slow, you seem to I lost a rune. I mean my rune. So you see, I'm a little stuck. And I need my rune, you see. You wouldn't mind finding it for me, would you? Sure thing, bro. You got it. Oh, thank you. It's somewhere on here in the sewers on your side of these bars. Bring it back to me quick. Okie dokie. I see you later. This way? Where's my time door? Ah, crap, it's down there. <gasps> I didn't waste all that floor for the time door not being good to me. Let's get a green so that we can get the HP out of it. That's my idea there. One second, mate. One second. I've gone the wrong way. It's only because I recognise this area as being unlikely to take us to the time door. We seem to be continuing the floor. You know, that's the sort of thing you've got to do when you're going to be in an MLP, an MLG, an N NCP, an NPC gamer, you know? You've got you to gotta be able to look for the subtle clues that the, uh, the game is giving you. Why can't I go through these archways, by the way? The background, there's stuff behind there, I know I can see it. Why am I leaving a green trail? Pretty gross. Our uh, DPS is great <laughs> when we have the DPS thing on and also 
um, these these triple shot mix mix bag mix sushi thingies. I would like a better secondary weapon because I really don't make good use of bows. Owie, meanie boy. I rolled into the thingy to get away from the other thingy. At some point, you just have to pick your damage and just go for the, let, let the one that is the least bad damage hit you. I don't know which one that is. You just have to do it. So that's the goal anyway. I would very much like to have a second part of my HP vial so that I can um, heal more than once on the level, which is kind of difficult like the sewers because, of course, the sewers has a lot of sewage, which hurts. So it turns... Anyway, it turns out Envy Yank is not that bad, or at least it's no worse than doing it in software, at least the software I have, which is FFmpeg. Well, it's the X264 that comes with Linux, the LibX264, you know. So I think it's the same one I was using anyway, because for the longest time, of course, you saw me on you and I play, I was stitching videos together from the video source and the vocals. We're not using any of our um, skills, by the way, which I've forgotten I had. Which is a good sign, because it means I'm not relying on them, which means I don't need them yet. <laughs> I guess it's the obvious thing to say there. Um, I don't need them. Which means when the game gets harder, I will have them. They'll be available. Let's do this now, though. That was the wrong one. Switch them around. Nice. Um, so... FFmpeg is what I was using at the time to render the output video from stitching together the input video and the other one, but of course uh, I'm, I might as well use this. Um, X264 no, yeah, the FFmpeg X264 library was the open source one because and then NVENC was what the input video was made of, so but I don't know what the bitrate of the output video was To be honest, I don't remember the, uh, why, why roll that way? You've learned this lesson before. That's not how you do that either, but, you know, I didn't learn that lesson before. Um, so what is, what is going on? Someone teach me the ins and the outs of this. I know what a bitrate is in principle. You know, we learn those with MP3s. We, we need a certain number of bits per second in order to be able to render that many frames per second because each frame is made of bits and the more bits you have the more data you can put in each frame even though there's a compression algorithm that means you need fewer bits per frame it's way more bits to not have the compression algorithm so if i put this up, i've put this up to um let me just take that can i sell these can i I'm not on my... I haven't got a celly file yet. Someone just give me the lowdown. Why did I have the impression that MVNC was terrible? Well, probably, I had the impression because people told me it was terrible, but... I mean... Is it? <laughs> or... Is just... A high bit rate necessary? Are all these blog posts on the internet lying to me? <clears throat> when they tell me that you don't really need anything other than... I don't know why I ran to this teleport, by the way. You know, up to 5k. That seems nonsense. 5k did nothing for me, even when I used software encoding. Ooh. Is this better? No. I prefer the trap for now. I don't want either of those, and I can't sell them, so I'm not even going to bother swapping around. <laughs> Have a chew. I've told you before how much I like the Frost Blast, and I will not apologise for it, because it's not something to be sorry about. I mean, everyone's got a favourite weapon. In Call of Duty... Uh, I was going to say United Defensive, no. I mean... Oh, no, it was United Defensive. Remember that? Podulo? 
realism mode, my weapon of choice would be the sniper rifle. I always played backup in that. Uh, poison heals you instead of wounding you. What a perfect place for this. Hello. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm just gonna drink this poison. It's, uh, it's, it's green juice, which is like orange juice, but completely different colour. I mean, I don't need to be full health. It's okay. Uh, more HP, please. And then, of course, it would take even longer for the poison to heal me, but here we are. Are we rolling purple or red? Good question. I've got four in red at the moment, and two red things. I've got three in purple at the moment. Purple things. But also, I'm likely to want to put a fair amount in green, because green gives you a lot more HP in the general sense, I guess, but maybe... I mean, that tails off pretty quickly, but I do have a green item as well. Which is not something I'm using, so it's probably not something to really put that much uh, stock in right now. That being said... Careful. Didn't have time to roll. My bad. Got to pick your battles. Um, I do tend to find myself finishing off an enemy and then finding that the other one, which I was going to roll through, was already fired and I, my roll is not ready. You know, you got to know your roll. I don't want that even to sell. Ramparts. What's that zigzag down there? It's a door that you can't get through. Aha! There you are. Right. Hello. It's here. The My rune is just a bit further on. Mm, yes. Your rune. No way, bro. Well, not at all. Nothing to worry about. To come in this far, you'll make short work of all that. So, off you go. You know how I didn't say I'm... You know how I said I'm not going to take the Izdar because... I don't want to fight an elite. Here, how I'm fighting an elite. Wow. I'm going to jump over that if you possibly can. I've learned, through trial and mistake, that these things can't turn around when they're trapped. So just get behind them and attack. That was easy mode. I have come to a greater appreciation for traps. <sighs> Kane. I mean, bear trap. Not. It's just rude, mate. <laughs> Stop calling them that. Um, that. Now that I've learned that they stop. There's a vine to what looks like a shield, so I'm going to ignore it. Um, they, they prevent the enemy from turning around, because that means you can get a good few hits in. On the uh, on the the old flanking manoeuvre on the old backside there, before they become untrapped. I had 50 cells from that floor. 50 cells from that floor, which is why it's good to go for the the time door. Yes. Let's start unlocking some things like this. So you want to get. Let's put five away from that, and we'll fill up this one. I'm not too keen on the broadsword. I did use it before. I don't know if you were with me for that. Let's get rid of, uh, let's get mutation, the cooldown on skills that aren't grenades. I know it didn't affect the skill that is a grenade, because the skill that is a grenade is not not grenade, but I do tend to prefer in many cases the skill that isn't a grenade. I like the ice grenade. I don't know if that's true, actually. I think the skills are just, in general, kind of decent. We are a bit late for this time door, which is a shame, but I did do a lot of exploring on that floor, and we unlocked the rune that actually lets us get further in the game, which is good. It's always good to have some progress on each uh, floor, lest you become somewhat uh, jaded. You can, you can start getting a little bit despairy. I don't want to fight you. I just wanted to see if there was anything up there, because we don't want to miss any... Scrolls now that we have missed the time door, which is a guaranteed scroll. We want to take... I think I'll go red with a back end of purple, but I don't know if that's necessarily the best thing. Is there anything here? It's pause, but there's nothing to investigate. It's a rack. There's nothing. Ooh, mind you. A tunnel. This tunnel was cleared out very roughly. Doesn't look too solid. I've been in one of these and I didn't know what it meant. 
The steel bag that someone left there a long time ago. The time door's this far away as well. A drumstick is good to know about. Tight passage. Ha ha ha. The hole in the wall is extremely small. The cat sat on the mat. Except maybe for a child. Do you have one? No. Then don't mention it. No. Just bring a child to escape from the prison even though you're dead today. Look. There's a lot of hinted at lore in this game. Right? And... To be honest... I have no idea what's happening. Why am I apparently a ghost contain, uh, contained within the same body each time? Or something. And then I die and then there's a bunch of stuff that happens and then I die again and then I get a little Like, there's all this prison malarkey and all that majiggery. It's still very well and good. I understand that there are zones or biomes. Nah, they're not really biomes. That's more of a geological term. Geographical term? Geologographical term. Meteorological term, perhaps. Um, but I do appreciate, by the way, having a weapon that is fast enough to kill those things before they strike, because they strike fast. Ow! Fair play to you. I thought I dodged through that. Turned out I hadn't. I thought I would have stunned you. Turned out I hadn't. Learning a lot of things about myself today. There is nothing down here. Very well. Anything up here? Uh, but there's sort of a lot of lore that doesn't necessarily sort of fill in any knowledge gaps for me. Uh, I assume that the wiki has more information than this, but, you know, wiki smicky, right? <laughs> don't tell me what I don't know. That was just hard luck, I have to be honest. Anything up here? Sell, please. Okay. There's a lot of money. I don't seem to have any opportunity to spend it. And I'm not going to keep more than half of this. As it's like the half of what I've currently got, not half of what I end up with. Uh, in fact, I'm going to keep less than half of what I've currently got. So It's nice having a quick weapon in all situations. Maybe something like the Ice Blast uh, would make the broadsword more palatable. Mm -hmm. There we go. You are frozen in a very compromising position, young man. I like it when you're frozen in midair. Kind of thought that maybe your aerodynamics doesn't work once you, your wings were entombed in lumps of ice. It's not very satisfying when you try and do this downward stomp and it just stops immediately and then there's another one. Oh, far down. Bridge? Yes. Ah, move! <laughs> I don't think we want to go to the bridge yet. Just yet. We can get more out of this floor is what I'm thinking. I wonder what time the next door is. Roll. Or just don't roll. I don't care. <laughs> just don't be in the way of the attack. I don't care how you don't be in the way of the attack. Uh-oh. I like it that you're invincible when you're doing this because I'm going to be doing this. So... What's down here? Ooh. Things to kill. Hmm. Expected maybe a little bonus for bothering to go down there, but no. Rolling through the door. Give me some more scrolls. Give me some more HP. Well, yeah, HP, but... That was more of an Isaac thing to say. There's a scroll. There you go. With HP in it. Definitely take the larger amount of HP in this situation. We have quite a lot of damage, and... Ooh. Ow. I got a rampart from the ramparts. Is this a good time to run away? No, because I can still heal. I haven't used my heal yet. Even though I only have one, I still have it. You have got a scroll. Well done, sir. Good show. Red, please. Doing reasonably well with just this small amount of equipment that I do have. I mean, it's the same amount of equipment that I normally have in short quantity, but it's not necessarily the same amount that I have in sort of power points. Why is PowerPoint called PowerPoint? Hmm. 
Right, what's it got to do with electrical outlets? Is it... Everyone knows what PowerPoint is, but it's not that. I've got an ice grenade, an infantry grenade four, which would beat my infantry grenade three to some extent, which I'm not using. Another trap or an ice grenade. I might as well spend my money on another trap. Victims burn and then damage the burning target. This will help me with the boss, which we have yet to beat on this save file, which is the only true save file as far as you're concerned. And therefore, hopefully we can get a little bit further than said boss in this episode, which will be super grand. Uh, I think I'm ready to just go. It's all the same to you. Blackbridge Ramalan. Oh, Blackbridge. Right, I'm going to drink the rest of this OJ. Glamorously from Concentrate. Well, 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 look who's here. Did you expect me not to be here? You know how this works. Furthermore, what are you doing here? I thought I killed you yesterday. Um, we will take Recycling 1, because we haven't even started to upload, upload that. That's what I said, that's what I meant. Talking about. Uh, I don't like many of my survival, <laughs> my mutations. Uh, we might want this in future, but I don't really want it right now. I don't know. 4 HP after each enemy dies, but there's only one enemy. The This is one of those annoying, quote-unquote, annoying bosses where they don't spawn any minions, so you don't get the benefit of anything that benefits you when things die. Okay. Right, so we just attack the back of this thing until the... That's a bit rude, isn't it? Let me do it again. Roll. <laughs> the, uh... I realised that the, the flame from the wolf trap somewhat relied on, um... Ow. Right, that was that animation. I thought it wasn't, but it was. My mistake. The, uh... Fire from the wolf trap... Oh, no, don't stand in front of it. Relies on the uh, enemy dying. <laughs> Let's have some more trash. No, done it again, mate. Stop it. Learn your frippin' lesson. Roll past it, stab it a bunch. Thought you would turn around before you got trapped again. Guess I was wrong. You're not ready yet. And then jump. The traps are really helping, actually. Come on in. Bite your legs off. Where was my frost burst, which I quite clearly asked for? Kind of half expecting it to do something that means I shouldn't be close to it. Yep, yeah, like that. Exactly like that. Bad. Grand. Perfect. Nothing wrong with that. That was not scum tactics. That was the game. Okay. It wouldn't give me these... Oh, hello. It wouldn't give me these things if it didn't want me to use them to beat the boss, you know? You are getting out of that trap way too fast in my life, young man. Don't appreciate the fact that my traps ain't working no more. I can get two hits in and then I have to run away. I don't like what you're doing. Stop it. Get over it. Keep jumping, that's right. The traps are at least in the very worst case, doing some um, decent interruptions. So I can sort of rely on it. Ah, ooh. Not being able to do most of its attacks. Help. Sometimes. <laughs> ah. No. You're going too fast, mate. Chill out. Resist. You can't resist. It's not allowed. 
No. Well, shows me right for relying on traps, I guess. Nah. He's not done it. He's gone and not done it again. That boss hard, man. That boss hard. What did I do when I beat it and you didn't get to record? You didn't get to see it. I can't remember. Relying on traps, we have learned. Lim diminishing returns on the same enemy. I don't know if it's the same enemy or if that boss just becomes immune to them. But anyway, let's call it there. That's a 25-minute episode. So rather than accidentally make an hour one, I'm going to say thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying the series. Thank you for, once again, coming across from the previous channel or just joining me from the ether, wherever you came from, however you materialize here. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for leaving a like or a comment or something along those lines to let me know how you think the series is going and blah, blah, blah. So until next time, again, thank you for watching this one and I'll see you.